Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Season Goal as a Vunny. Now in the last episode we did not have a single battle and I'm not sure if we're going to have one in this as well to be honest. I'm sorry if you are hoping upon that but we want to secure our faction a little better. Now in the last episode we just ended by having our units. Uh, running around and um, setting spear warriors as our uh, defense to the north. Now we do not have anyone over here but I could actually make them myself. They will not have the bonus but yeah we are going to do that. And we also have a good and decent defense right over there. If we do that, we'll lose lots and lots of units. So we will not. Um, so you will go back instead. And wait for the winter to be over so you can deliver the units. So at the moment the situation is, uh, is looking quite quite good, especially with our economy. Now we're going to hit a minus five here. Ooh, that's I'm actually going to stop that so we don't go into minus. Uh, I do not like that at all. So and we're already in minus over here, minus four, which is quite quite bad. But next turn which is now. This turn we will have our chieftain hold. Now this will enable us to gain a huge public bonus to our settlements. And that's good. So they will probably suffer some attrition right now. Yeah, yeah, a bit. Not that much actually. I did fear uh, it was more. So actually quite satisfied it wasn't more damage. And. Uh, it looks like I built a spear warrior instead of chosen uh, spearman. Whoops. Now I want to have more missile units. And how many is left after that? So I have three units left. So if we Gain three of Swan will have a very good uh, force attack force and uh, defense capabilities. Now this will give quite a lot minus, which we do not want. What we want instead is this. We we'll lose some of our. Um, what is it called? Uh, bonus to wealth in some regions. Uh, but we will gain them back. But we need this public bonus uh, quite quite badly. Uh, and fortunately only three turns. So it should not matter at all over here. Now as you can see we are done in here. Done in here and unlocked the first one. But what we're going to do. We're not going to dis do this. We're going to use our money to unlock even more of these because we have the economy to do this now. So we can quickly research a lot, which is quite nice. So 
Sorry about that. My belly is speaking. Uh, yeah, we're just going to speed run all of these, so we can quickly be over with these late spring, late spring, early spring. So as of now, just nine. And this will be done in turn, so we're actually going to do this. Now, that was quite expensive, but totally worth it. Now, these are going to expand right there, yes. And you're going to have four new units. Yay! Defense. Now, this army will go and stand right here. It will be preparing to invade this faction. And actually go down here instead. So we need to be careful that we don't uh, upgrade too much so we go into minus with food. What do a Timble of the Oak? It's most likely something over here. Don't know why, but I have a feeling that it's not just. Or is it? That would actually be quite, quite. Temple of the Oak. Yes, we want more um, food. We need more food. So, our situation is quite, quite good. Rude champion, we will not, and we'll actually make more of these. Minus 10 public order is quite a lot. <coughs> so, we will be careful by building too many of these. So, they will will give us minus six for each of these we are building which is quite a lot I will I'm quite concerned about our food situation um, to be honest but I do believe this should be able to support it But it's not our money which is an issue anymore. So instead of having tax raise, I will actually make food edicts instead. Bread and what is it called? Bread and games. Yeah. To make the situation around our food slightly better than it's at the moment. So we have. A very strong army standing right here and they are ready to venture over to the mates you can't no he can't if you go out here just band this so we're going to before we're going to end let's see yeah, this will also be quite important because it will give us the possibility to make those f the single, I believe, actually, the single pot we have to gain more food for us, which is actually one of our concerns uh, in this game at the moment. So, either issue, issue, faction destroyed. Four chieftains, quite good. We will wait. Uh, building the new army. So. 
Gears love the open road. For the throne. Call this a garrison. Nice. Looking quite good. I believe I can survive that hit over there. We got 10. 4, 6, 12. We can't survive a double hit, so we will take one of 14 food. It's also quite a lot, 14 food, actually. So we might not be needing uh, this, which also would be quite nice. Now we used all our money, uh, actually, so we'll have to cancel these. We want to use the money we get to expand in these directions. Cultural conversion. I actually do not believe cultural is such a big issue, but... Improvement capacity. Against room. Immunity. Always good. More wealth. Wow. 25. So we are 5,400 at the moment. And let's see with 25% bonus. Which might possibly be only 10. If it gave anything this turn. Not really. We're going to make this population surplus right up here. We're going to build this. You are going to defend. You're going to stand down here. So right now our focus, as you can see, is heavily upon making sure that we have enough money to keep our research rate on these areas um, this high. Mm. Ten research rate, quite good. We do not have those kind of money. So we're going to make this, one this, and this. And I don't know if we will make any of these. There are some quite nice things right here. I, I might, we might be focusing upon finishing all of these uh, before we are going to build our a primary army. Uh, more wealth. Uh, more wealth by a farmer's market. Don't know how many buildings are we doing right now. Not that many, to be honest. Uh, we have three on the way, two and four turns. I'm actually looking forward to see how much uh, impact we have on our food situation because we might be able to build other buildings around, which could help on uh, what is called public order situation in areas which needs it. So. Right now it looks quite, quite good, to be honest. Warm summer. So let's... So they are s uh, slowly decreasing uh, due to we are not expanding the negative effect and tribal unity 
might have an impact on this. I'm not sure. The gods will have me listen to you, but do not pass the day in words without merit. Let's going to see. It's low. Pulse oh, low, low. If I should have a good uh, opportunity to achieve this, I believe I will have to take the small ones. Like, I believe I have a decent chance of making these join me. I'm not sure, but I believe actually my best chance would be these. And it's low. So we will be needing more. A flapping tongue that speaks without wisdom is not welcome. Be like a spear and have a point. Ha <laughs> It's actually moderate, so we might actually be able to gain this area. Now, do I want this? I will be able to gain the army, so it could actually be worth it. But we're going to end it. We want the research to be done first. I know it might prove to be wrong if they lose their settlement. Um, but that's a chance I'm willing to take right now. So we are done in all three areas in the second tier. So the question now is what should we build in the third tier to begin with? Now this is to improve our army. So no need for that at the moment. Research rate would be quite good. This would go faster, but we don't need it right now. Public order, quite, quite good as well. But what we actually need is more income. So. I'll actually make more well from agricultural, uh, but it seems like that bonus is not 25 onto 25. Because if it was, I believe that would just be absurd. Might be. I can't answer that for sure. So we're going to end this, and next turn we might be lucky to be able to build the second one. I'm not sure, to be honest. We are able, so Great Food Vault should help us improve our economy. We're going to build this, which also should give us better situation in our money. Faction destroyed, I'm sorry about that in the top. Now let's see what factions do we not have trade with. And, and the funny thing here is why do they not want trade? The gods will have me listen to It seems like we do you not have oh? a chance to gain Greetings, friend. any trade uh, besides those we already Greetings, have trade friend. with. Uh, the reason to this, I do not know, to be honest. I do believe it's quite weird. Mission issued, I don't care. Massilia. Well, who owns Massilia? So they have increased in size now. That can be good, that can be bad. Let's see. Imperium conversion. Yeah, let's build it. So we are done in that research tree. Which is quite nice. If I should say so myself, uh, which I am doing. So recruitment cost is cheaper all around now, which is quite good. But we only have 7,000. So we can't actually build something this turn, but we could build something next turn. But instead, should we not focus upon making this area experience rate? quite quite good to be honest but I do not feel the need for the military area as of now that's actually quite good so 
yeah so we have some money to use now we got 17 and giant unless that will the good thing about this is this sh weapons tree and arm two and Want to help increase the group minus eight? That's quite a lot, to be honest. Let's see, we got seventeen. Minus four, it's thirteen. Minus six is seven. So we should actually be able to do this. And next turn, we will upgrade this settlement in. Ooh, My who's ancestors that? have spoken well of you, and so we offer a treaty. The worthy make the best friends. I agree. The reason why I'm hoping to have a better relationship with them and use that to let's see, treaties yeah. It definitely bumped up our relationship. Speak plainly and without if I ask for trade and offer some well. Money. Sure thrust strikes home after all. Wow. Is it even worth it? No, <laughs> it's not. Uh, join me, and you gain all of the money I have. No. And I do believe if I ask. Please, they will not join I me now, because they have become that strong, yeah. So, that's nice. These might join me. Might. Nope. The problem is, when a faction have a strong economy, if you ever have been in and ask for demand money from a place, you will see that you have minus 10 that's quite a lot uh, uh, sorry just got distracted uh, but if you have ever been in to make a agreement diplomatic agreement which I believe you have and demanded for money you would have been able to see that when you as for money, it says weak, moderate, or strong. Now, if it's strong, it will mean that the what is it called? Uh, they will a weak faction will t see seven thousand eight hundred as a lot of money or a weak economy faction will see that as a lot of money a moderate will see it as decent amount a strong will see it as little money because when you demand money from a strong faction and you press upwards it's two thousand two thousand in a strong so you come and say seven thousand uh, well it's three and a half click that's not uh, very much so often they will not take it so it's actually something to remember when you are trying to make diplomatic agreements now several of these well, the public order in this region is not that great to be honest it's actually quite terrible and I don't understand why it's so terrible. Mm. Buildings. Minus 32. Which are these buildings? Which... Uh, is it because... No. I, actually, I don't know. Oh... Because of these, all of the yeah, squalor, squalor, yeah, 
but I just have to live with it. Uh, down here I can gain both. So I'm going to build that next turn down here and I have the hard decision to make if should I decide to wage war upon faction which I'm saying blood in but I could actually take my army here and march against Rome if I have this or this one it doesn't actually really matter and then I could see these units are the same as these so if I take this general over here and ex exchange them so this general will lead them and this army will go towards them I actually believe that's what I'm going to do so we will start to wage war now the first battle will probably first be in the next episode yeah I don't care about those so you gain these three and I gain okay so it's a weak army standing up there right now but I do not really care we're just going to create a small defensive force small defensive force we want a little uh, military force here to protect us if we should be attacked we need someone who can respond now these are not that well uh, trained either so it can become an issue I'm not sure but it could so Let's see, minus 11, ouch. That's, that's a lot. How do we change the minus 11? We raise one of these which give us 14 food. That's, that's quite a lot to lose actually. But maybe I should be focusing upon having one of these in each region instead of having it in one. Now I will soon have another over here and I should be able to support it. So I'm going to destroy this as much as I hit it and I will build a temple instead to increase the public order in this uh, area because that should of course it also lost a bit of um, public order due to I removed my army That is, of course, also something to remember. Mm. Minus 10, is 10, five. Uh, well, I can't. I can't do that just yet. Two, that's not a lot. I should believe I'm going to make this instead. So we got a lot of money right now, so it looks quite okay. So this is the episode, the next one will start with us beginning a war with 
Rome. Now, I'm quite excited myself to see how this will go if Rome is very superior or not. So, I hope you enjoyed this episode and I hope you look forward to the next one where we will have battle. If you did enjoy this, please like, subscribe or comment and until next time, bye.